one of the hottest congressional races in the country, but it's a race neither candidate was prepared for just three weeks ago. Republican Richard Tassay and Democrat Seth Moulton got some new numbers today. Janet Wu reports neither are comfortable with them. How are you? I'm Seth Moulton. I'm running for Congress. Oh. The 6th Congressional District is now an open seat with incumbent John Tierney eliminated in the primary. Democratic newcomer Seth Moulton, a former Marine with four tours of Iraq under his belt, has about half the cash on hand of Republican and former state senator Richard Tassay, who is running for the second time for the seat. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Okay, same here. A new WBUR poll shows the little known Moulton eight points ahead with less than six weeks left in the election, but the numbers mean little to either of them. Absolutely not comfortable. You know what? Two years ago, I was eight points ahead at this point. He lost by one percentage point to longtime incumbent Tierney. But Moulton has an impressive resume Harvard, the Marines, and he's a fresh face. He is going to support the far right agenda that's being in, endorsed by the National Republicans, and that's not what we need to break the gridlock. I'm pro choice. I'm gay. I'm married. I'm, uh, and I have no problem looking John Boehner in the eye and saying no. To say also claims this district is more moderate than most of Massachusetts. Republican candidates have won this district in the last three U.S. Senate elections and the 2010 gubernatorial race. I want to be a change agent uh, and help move the country forward and also help change the Republican Party on the issues that I care most about. Republicans shut the government down, and he's not going to be able to change that. And in fact, he's just going to empower that majority by being another Republican vote in the House. Now, the stakes are so high in this race that both the national, Democratic, and Republican parties are getting ready to spend a half a million dollars each in the final weeks. Tierney's defeat forced them to quickly reframe their messages, so expect a lot of negative ads to pop up soon. Erica, JC.